conical bottom tubes. Everyone who works in molecular biology knows how important they are, but what you may not realize is how important uh, the plastic that it's made out of is. And you have two different types. You have polypropylene, polystyrene. How to tell the difference. So the, the really the best way is to compare um, how clear they are. So polystyrene will be completely see-through, almost like glass, whereas polypropylene is a little bit cloudy. If you can't compare them, you can always hit them with a hammer. So if I use polystyrene and I smack it, it shatters. And this actually is very similar to what happens when you spin it at very high speed, say, for a maxi prep. Uh-oh, all of your solution is now in the bottom of your centrifuge. So good luck cleaning that out. Whereas with the polypropylene, it really doesn't, it's very resistant to shattering. That's how you can know that you've polypropylene and that yes, you can spin it at high speeds and hooray, everything will work out, okay. In conclusion, for most usage, polypropylene, not polystyrene.